Hello everybody, it's Christy from Christy's Beautiful Life. Welcome back to 30 Days of Sketches 7. We are on to day 26. Can you believe that? The sketch today was chosen by the lovely Katie Scott from Scrappy Sisters. And I am showing you right here that I am have that that gorgeous pattern paper this is the hello just a little lovely excuse me just a little lovely collection from pink fresh studios and i bought that collection that particular pattern paper for that side of the pattern paper but i'm not going to use it and i'm also showing you here how i have my triangle and i was going to use it on this pre-mixed media background but instead you saw that little floral half wreath there and i felt like that just kind of jived a little better together. So that's gonna get put aside and be another layout for another day. Kind of just showing you what had happened there. For some reason with this recording, I don't know, but the beginning of my video didn't record and the end of my video uh, didn't record. Thankfully, you don't miss a whole lot. I do keep this pretty simplistic. I just kind of went with how everything was fitting together for me and what I had on hand because I don't have very much of this collection left. It is one of the five collections that I had a goal to use up before I could do any more shopping and I with this layout and the layout you saw me kind of showing you I I've killed this collection so it makes me very happy and it's always nice to use up some more of your stash. The hexagons that you can see, they are a cut file that I received. It was just one of the cut files I already had cut. And it is one that has three um, hex, it's three by three. So it turns into a 12 by 12, but there's three hexagons um, length and width sort of thing. So I just cut them up and made them work for me. And then the photo was taken when we went to the pumpkin patch last October. And it's just kind of the first time the kids really got to have a little bit of freedom after, you know, being basically stuck at home with the whole COVID thing. So that's kind of what this layout's about is just uh, a moment <laughs> and everything's going to be okay. And that's kind of what my title is saying is, hey, keep going. And my journaling will kind of reflect that as well. Now, like I said, this is going to kind of cut back and I will talk live to wrap up the layout, but I didn't, again, I didn't use a whole lot. I kind of used what I had on hand within the collection and then I brought a few things in from uh, the, the Creative Cut Club collection I had from this particular cut file and it all just wraps up together and I really... I like this layout. It's a little bit different for me. Um, there's a lot of white, quote unquote, white space, but I feel like in the end it ties in and I do really like it and it's going to tie in perfectly with everything else. So I'll be back live in one moment and you'll see the rest of the layout. Hello everybody. So I'm not sure what happened, but it cut out. So let me just show you what um, I did. You didn't miss a whole lot. This is a, a pretty simplistic layout, but um. I'm really happy with how it turned out. So you saw me do this part. You saw me do this part. You saw me switch it. I had it on a different background, did all that. The only things that I ended up adding were some foam stickers for some extra pop of white. I was struggling with this and having nowhere else, having it nowhere else and what to do. I felt like something probably should go down here, a bigger title, like an actual title, some journaling, I don't know, something was needed. But what I ended up finding were these cute little wood veneer that were in my Creative Cuts Club with this particular cut file that same month. So I went ahead and used that. I got some, everyone be happy, look at that. I'm so close to being done with that package that I can get rid of it and say, hey, I have no enamel dots anymore. Um, but yeah, so I finished those up, which is awesome. I guess I don't hate enamel dots. I just, I don't think to use them. I don't know what I, what I think. Um, did that. I, I added this hello. So it says, hello, hey, keep going, which I like because they're running. And I think that's everything. I didn't do a whole lot. I did this little strip, but I think you saw that on camera. Um, so I kept this one pretty basic, but I like it. It's a little different than the sketch, right? Like the sketch kind of has all these layers up to here being the diagonal with the hexagons like on that. I like this a little bit more. And I think you guys saw that in the, the 
voiceover part of this, but I sacrificed this piece of paper. <sighs> Everyone just take a moment. <laughs> I can't believe I did it. I cannot believe I bought this particular pad of paper for that. But this background is just the perfect. It's just the perfect background. Like it just works, right? And you all know how much I've been loving mix, the pre-mixed media background. So I just went with it. And it's not white cardstock, which is awesome as well. And I I don't hate it. That's for sure. I like this layout. I, I'm not sure where the journaling's going to go. I have to kind of play with that. I'm thinking... Um, Maybe a little bit here and a little bit here and maybe wrap it up here so it might be like in little sections. That might be possible. I'm not sure. But there you have it. So there is day 26. You guys, we only have four, 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 four days left. And I hope you've been enjoying this. I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye.